Hey guys, how's it going? Kaprain here. So I talk a lot about RNG and Hearthstone and all that, and I think it's generally kind of negative. We've kind of crossed the line of fun RNG most of the time when someone loses. It's just, you know, it feels really bad. And RNG is such a commonplace thing in Hearthstone that when you win with typical, like, unless it's like the 0.1% of RNG, it's not even really that exciting. So it's, you know, it's an interaction, a video game that has a net negative effect, and that kind of sucks, right? But there is kind of a positive side to RNG, kind of pushing the high roll. It's kind of interesting in Arena. I don't think it shows up too much in Constructed. Maybe there's some bad matchups that it shows up in, but in Arena, it's actually kind of interesting. When you're playing a deck that you know isn't very good, and you know you have a few, like, few ways to win, few ways to combo a few cards, few chances you know you have to take in order to win because, you know, your deck is bad or your deck might not be bad, but no, maybe you're you're running like an average deck and you're at like 10 and 0, so you know all of your opponents are going to have way better decks. You're forced into these positions where you have to take risks, and usually these risks are based off of RNG effects. It's kind of like you know, because you're an experienced player and you know kind of the, the matchmaking involved, the percentages involved, you put yourself in a position to actually gain that chance to win. And I really like that aspect in card games in general, and Hearthstone actually does a pretty good job with that side of the RNG in the game. So today, I wanted to highlight some of the good RNG in Hearthstone and uh, some pretty interesting games that I think you guys would appreciate the, the risky plays in. So check it out. Hope you guys enjoy them, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. The Doom Knowledge is power. Got the sick combo here. You know it's gonna make it more sick? You guys ready for it? This is next level. Getting rid of the sick combo. Sweet. Yeah. Isn't that good? Oh, actually, that's... Oh, that's an even sicker combo! Alright, dude, I'm, I'm game for that. There you go. Yeah, if I just play the mana bind, it's gonna pick up his coin. It's gonna be garbage. <laughs> okay, dude. All right, chill out with these secrets, dude. Gadgets and Gazette always gets the scoop. Holy crap, dude. Can we, like, get something else? It's like six mana everywhere. The ping is valuable because we might play the Corrupted Seer. Played against me in an arena, you got some of the best luck in your life, and then you've got... Got proceeded to lose three games in a row right after. Okay. Right, sounds sounds about right, dude. Okay. Boom. Oh fuck! That's a murloc. No! Rip and piece vaporize. Yeah, I got wrecked. Say hello to my little friend. Nothing else really works at all, so I guess this is the one we go with. Rip vape nash. Yeah. Do I recommend Art of Conquest? 
No, I'm still playing. I've been playing for like a month and a half now. Uh, servers kind of get a bit imbalanced in population. But uh, other than that, it's uh, it's pretty good. You just gotta play it for your own reasons, like... Oh! Oh! Yes! Like, uh, you know, some people just play games to wreck noobs, and then that plan doesn't work in the long term. Like, it never works in the long term. And they're like, oh man, I wish I was wrecking noobs and stuff. Like, you play a game, if you think it's fun, you keep playing. That's how it works. Because uh, might have like a heal totem or something. Yeah, I uh, I think I'll play some hots tonight. I'm not sure, but I think so. Ooh. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm. Yes, thank you. Sweet positioning, bro. Lich build and Archon meet expectations. I still haven't uh, hit endgame, but yeah, it's doing pretty well because most of the quest hubs in this area are undead, and uh, a lot of the people playing humans are really struggling against undead quests. And I think it'll work out in the end. I wonder. The, the mummies are real garbage, so uh, if I did it again, I'd probably just go with the melee skeletons, even though they suck. Uh, I can at least Whoa. spam them. Mummy is actually like a trash tier unit. someone Basically, needs to kill everything, so I don't see that happening. Man, that's a pretty ridiculous hand. I mean, turn one, we play these. Oh, that's a little wasteful, huh? I'm gonna do it anyway. I only care about tempo. I want him to use his hero power, kill the 2-1, one, 1-2, one, runs into my guy, and then I play Fledgling. And no answer, I win. Right? Yep. It's fine. And keep in mind, I'm playing a really bad deck at 8-1, so making a risky power plays is just fine. Hey, hey, you want to buy a funnel cake? Fury win, fury win, fury. Damn it. My mother does love this fan. Ah! 
<laughs> oh man, that's dirty as hell. All right. No wind fury. I know, right? What the fuck? Give it a death rattle or whatever. Well played. My jeopardy. Dude, I don't care. I don't care. Give me one, Fury. Man. Fine. What's the worst that could happen? Let's be real. Okay, I could disconnect. That would be bad. Alright, but other than that... Yeah, alright, cool. 